Well, Sharon, Tyndall Air Force Base is facing cuts as a result of this decision. A project at the base in Panama City is one of 127 in 23 states and around the world that are now on the chopping block. Now, some of these projects include air, uh, aircraft hangars and firing ranges to child care, and they're now being gutted. Tyndall will now lose $17 million that was meant to fund a new fire rescue and crash response station. This comes after the facility suffered catastrophic damage during Hurricane Michael. Puerto Rico also among the hardest hit of all the U.S. states and territories as it was more than $400 million in funding diverted. Now, most of those projects that were happening were as a result of the hurricane there, which is why defense experts are sounding the alarm over this change. In this case, there are concerns that some of the funding that's being taken is hurting uh, hurricane recovery. The move is now facing backlash from lawmakers on both sides of the aisle. Many of them are calling on the Pentagon to restore the funding for a number of these projects, and they're looking for alternative ways to get the cash there. Now, Senators Marco Rubio and Rick Scott also have said in recent days that they are committed to helping Tyndall recover from Hurricane Michael. We're live on Capitol Hill this evening. Samantha Giraffe, Spectrum News 13. In the